use someone else's quote you might have heard it Joseph Campbell he talks about the cave you fear holds the treasure you seek and I and I love that I think if there was only one step we take in order to have a successful life in terms of fulfillment inside as well as creating the outer world of our dreams the one piece of advice to achieve that would be do the things that make you scared that feel purposeful too but they make you feel scared. That's the evidence we're entering the cave that we fear that has the treasure that we seek. And I think ultimately what that helps us do is live more aligned with our heart. So man, I think if there was only one thing we all did every day in order to help us create the inner and outer lives we want, it would be do something that makes us feel afraid. UK second lockdown top tips. First of all, have a rant, get it all out of your system, then start asking the right questions if it affected you as a small business like it has for me. So ask the questions on what can I do? How can I pivot? What can I do to make things better? How can I service my clients? What things can I learn that can real change and grow myself or even my business uh, into uh, the next year, 2021? Uh, also keep your mindset in check, keep ha active, stay healthy, keep doing things, get out, exercise, stay on top. Many people say to me, I wouldn't have the confidence to do that. I'm not confident enough to do that. If only they took a step back and understand that all we need is just a little bit of courage, let go of some fear, take a step forward, and that's it, our confidence will grow. See, the worst person to let you down is yourself, but the one person we can rely on is ourselves. So take the courage, take a step forward, and let your confidence grow. Stay focused on the things that you can control. So often we get hung up on the things outside of our control, whether it be people, circumstances, events. It really consumes us, almost infects us. And we spend more time focused on that. Flip it right round. Stay focused on what you can control, whether that be your health, your mindset, your goals, your career, your business, schooling, whatever. Stay focused on that and everything else will fall into place. So comment below, what thing will you stay focused on and stay in control of today? Lots of people are feeling quite stuck at the moment in certain areas of life or just in life in general. So I got a good tip. You need to take some time out first of all. Get some paper, write down family, health, relationship, career, business, all these little subjects and write out where you are right now. Take some time to uh, audit, evaluate, are you, what bits are you happy about and what bits do you want to change. There we go. Always bounce back, never react, head held high, have courage. Being accountable does not mean that we should feel guilty in any way. Accountable means that, you know, you accept something is wrong or you've done a, made a mistake or you need to make an improvement and then you do something about it. But feeling guilty is just an energy that's just going to drain you down. So you shouldn't have to feel guilty about anything. But what you can do is if you, it's just an acceptance that maybe something didn't work out and now you can do something about it. So be accountable, not feeling, instead of feeling guilty. Lobster, I think we would consider that a luxury thing to eat if we were eaten out anywhere. My Nana though, she would disagree with you. For her, lobster was considered the poor person's food. The reason being is because she could go and catch it straight out of the sea where she lived, so they didn't have to pay for it. You see, sometimes we get overwhelmed with so much and all we need to do is take a step back and we see things very differently. So make sure you keep yourself that open mindset. We all need a pattern interrupt. So for feeling a little bit down or we're just not feeling ourselves, see if you can control into your life a little pattern interrupt. Could just be being a little bit silly sometimes, like a something like that to change our thought process. Uh, we will then all be okay. Oh, he's okay, he's happy playing Fortnite. That's his pattern interrupt for now. Pattern interrupt, see how you can make them work for you. Reaching your goals is a little bit like walking through a maze. So if you imagine walking through a maze and you come to a dead end, it's like, oh no. 
You don't just stop and fall to the ground. You turn around and you might have to go back on yourself a little bit and you find the next route and you walk around again. Oh, oh no, it's a dead end again. You turn, you go back until eventually you get out. The maze is never straightforward and neither is the things that you're working towards. All right, so next time you come across a hurdle, you can either break through, jump over, or you might just have to take a little turn back, step back, and then you'll find the way out and you will soon get there. Peace, love. Do you have a coach for that thing that you want to work towards or improve on? Highly recommend it. See, sometimes we can get some great free stuff off YouTube. Don't knock it. However, if you want to go to that next tier, highly recommend you pay, invest in a coach that is going to help you grow in the area that you want to grow in. Otherwise, we just rely on the free and free will cost you later on. All right. Get yourself a coach. Get Stay on target and you will achieve those things much quicker than you believe. Relax. Lay back, relax. Stay focused on the things that you can control. So often we get hung up on the things outside of our control, whether it be people, circumstances, events. It really consumes us, almost infects us, and we spend more time focused on that. Flip it right round. Stay focused on what you can control, whether that be your health, your mindset, your goals, your career, your business, schooling, whatever. Stay focused on that and everything else will fall into place. So comment below, what thing will you stay focused on and stay in control of today? Let it go, let it go, let it go, let it go.